Gonna code, debug and have fun. Coding with Radu. Coding with Radu. Gonna optimize and refine. Coding with Radu. Coding with Radu. Let's code now. Last time on JavaScript Code Battle Tutorials, Leonard won using the array map method, an arrow function, and a ternary operator. Today's task is given an array of DNA sequences, find those that contain the gene CAT. I like cats. Begin. Radu begins by initializing his output array. Now he iterates through each gene in the input using the for each method. Looks like he's learning some more modern JavaScript techniques. Seriously, are you ever going to check on me today? I completed the task ages ago. Oh, oh, sorry, Leonard. Let's see. Aha! Leonard used the array filter method, a narrow function, and the string includes method to finish in just one line of code. Radu's code isn't really bad, but some things could have been shorter. Like here, he could have used an arrow function. And here, instead of index of, he could have used the includes method. It's not only shorter, but also easier to understand. With tricks like that and shorter variable names, maybe he would have stood a chance. Of course, the real reason Leonard won is using the filter method, which creates a new array with elements that match this same condition. So our winner once again is Leonard! Better luck next time!